an attack on Belgorod, Russia on December 30th last year. Local officials claimed 25 civilians were killed and more than 100 others were wounded in the attack. On Sunday, in Russia-controlled Donetsk, 27 others were reportedly killed and dozens injured in rocket attacks on a busy market and shops. Russia blamed Ukraine for both attacks. At a UN Security Council meeting, Happy New Year. Russia's foreign minister accused the West of providing Ukraine with the weapons it says are being used to kill civilians. The blood of dozens of killed civilians is on the conscience of those who arm Zelensky and saying at the same time that the authorities in Kyiv can themselves determine what the goals for the strikes will be. Before the meeting, Ukraine's ambassador to the UN took the opportunity to flank himself with ambassadors from allied countries in a sign of unity. In the meeting, he said the weapons are being used for self-defense and against Russian aggression. It is Im imperative to underscore that Russia's determination to inflict harm on Ukrainian civilians has not diminished. On the contrary, it has intensified significantly. During the briefing, Adedeji Ibo, a UN official that deals with disarmament issues, stressed the need to end the use of cluster munitions in this conflict by all sides. The United States transferred cluster munitions to Ukraine last year, and human rights groups have documented how that weapon has been used to kill or injure innocent civilians. Ukraine has received over 100 billion in military aid since the conflict began, 44 billion alone from the United States. Nearly two years after the war started, still deep disagreements over which weapons and from what countries are being used to wage this war. Gabriel Elizondo, Al Jazeera at the United Nations in New York. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.